Behavior to Structure Synchronization To evaluate and maintain the consistency of behavior and structure models can be tedious and time-consuming. It can be difficult to successfully create a structural model from scratch with reference to a behavior model. It is even more difficult to detect inconsistencies in later stages as the model evolves. Thus, there is a clear risk that models may become misaligned and inconsistencies may remain unnoticed. The Behavior to Structure Synchronization Check alleviates this problem. It consists of a validation rule that detects the parts having incompatible interfaces in accordance with flowing items specified in activities. Validation will warn you of any missing flows identified and suggest specific solver actions. There are four solver actions. Create port, choose compatible interface block, add missing flow property, and reverse direction of port. Let's see the behavior to structure synchronization check in action. To initialize the behavior to structure synchronization check, simply click the Check Behavior to Structure Synchronization button located in the Internal Block Diagram toolbar. As you can see, some parts are highlighted in yellow. It implies that some parts do not have compatible interfaces specifying the flows found in activities. To review which flows are not yet specified by the interfaces of the part, select the highlighted part and click the Validation button in the Smart Manipulator toolbar. All flows that the concrete part is currently missing are listed in the validation results. Each validation result shows the type and direction of the individual flow from the validated part perspective. You can use the navigation capability to quickly navigate to particular activity edges from which flows were identified. You can also select each of the parts between which exchanges of the item took place. Let's say you want to see where the flow of the item was found. For this, select the concrete item provided in the Navigate To options. As you can see, the activity edge is selected from which the flow was identified. As an alternative, you can use links provided in an error message to navigate to the selected element. For example, to navigate to the part from which the item is flowing, simply click on the underlined name of the part given in the error message. As a result, the part is selected in the internal block diagram. To solve each inconsistency, you can use one of the possible solver actions listed previously. Let's select a part called Human Machine Interface. In the Smart Manipulator toolbar, let's click on the Validation button that allows you to view each validation result specifically found for the selected part. As you can see, the validation result implies that the interface should specify the incoming flow of the user command. To solve this, inconsistency solver actions are tailored for the specific validation result. To view the suggested solver actions, Click on the validation result. The validated part does not have any proxy ports. Therefore, only one solver action is currently available called Create Port. In addition, a compatible interface block does not exist in the model. Thus, when the Create Port solver action is chosen, a new proxy port is created together with an interface block that has an incoming flow property specifying user command as its type. Let's see another example. This time, let's select the part called Audio Transmission that has some proxy ports. Let's view the validation results in the Smart Manipulator toolbar. Validation results indicate that the interface should specify the outgoing flow of the sound. When a validated part has proxy ports, Validation suggests an additional solver action called Choose Compatible Interface Block. As you select this action, a new dialog is shown, which lets you choose an existing proxy port owned by the validated part. 
Then you can select a compatible interface block to change the chosen proxy port type. Let's select the proxy port first. As you can see, the list provides all proxy ports that are owned by the validated part, regardless if ports are typed. Let's choose the proxy port that is not typed by any interface block. Then from the drop-down list of the compatible interface blocks, let's select the suggested interface block called iSound to type the chosen proxy port and press OK. The port is now typed by the compatible interface block iSound, specifying the outgoing flow property of the type sound. Thus, the inconsistency is resolved. In the following example, we focus on the internal block diagram context called wireless earbuds. Validation results imply that the interface should specify the incoming flow of the user command. Provided the wireless earbuds has some typed proxy ports, the add missing flow property solver action is suggested. To solve the inconsistency, let's select the add missing flow property solver action. As a result, a select dialog is shown listing all typed proxy ports that belong to the validated internal block diagram context. Let's select proxy port typed with the I status interface block. As you can see, the selected port is immediately updated. The interface block I status now has an additional incoming flow property of the type user command, which complies with the incoming flow of user command that was missing. In the last example, we have a part called processing. Validation results state that this part should have an interface specifying the outgoing flow of the energy status. However, this part already has a proxy port typed with an interface block that has the outgoing flow property of the type energy status. However, the proxy port is conjugated, therefore the flow property direction turns out to be the opposite. In these circumstances, Validation suggests an additional solver action called reverse direction of port that would change the proxy port direction. After this solver action is chosen, the proxy port direction is inverted. As a result, the proxy port now specifies the correct direction of the outgoing flow property typed by the energy status, which complies with the outgoing flow that was missing. To find more details about behavior to structure synchronization, please visit the link provided in the description. Thank you for watching.